Yeah. I'm here in Cleethorpes this evening to support Harbour Place. Uh, it's a charity who do wonderful work in uh, helping homeless people here in the, the Grimsby and, and Cleethorpes area. They're holding their annual charity fundraiser at the Beach Coma Club. I'm delighted to be here to support the, the charity um, and share a few of my stories in the world that I've been lucky enough to be involved in, in, in Premier League and international football refereeing. Now, you're no stranger to uh, Cleethorpes, Howard. Can you tell us a bit about that? Yeah, I suppose I'm fairly local. Uh, living in, in South Yorkshire, it's the, the place, I guess, that uh, we would always come to for a visit to the seaside. Um, and uh, that was as a kid myself with my parents and, and also my kids now. You know, if ever we want to uh, get a bit of, of sea air, then we uh, shoot up the, uh, the M18 and M118 over to, to Cleethorpes maybe for an afternoon. And, uh, and that might be six or seven times a, a year. Or it might even be a long weekend as well sometimes at somewhere like... Uh, like uh, Thorpe Park next to where we are now. So, yep, yeah, no strangers to this uh, this part of the world, and uh, of course, no visit is complete without uh, fish and chips for, for lunch or for tea. Yeah. Would you say refereeing is still an attractive interest for young people? I think so. I think more and more, actually. I think people are seeing the, the, the opportunities that, that football refereeing can, can offer. Um, in my case, it's led to, uh, to full time employment and some wonderful, wonderful experiences around the world. Um, I'm lucky enough to be refereeing Arsenal Tottenham this weekend. I was at Chelsea Liverpool last weekend, and that's for somebody who started doing junior football in Rotherham 21 years ago. You know, and, and of course that includes World Cup final and uh, Champions League final appearances. So that can happen to anybody. It happened to me. It can happen to anybody. And it's a great way if you've got a passion for the game to stay involved, to, to get fit, to keep fit, to play a positive part in the game that we all love. And, uh, and who knows where the journey might take you. Good. So it's tonight about showing a red card to homelessness. Absolutely, yeah. It's all about showing this, this red card to homelessness.